Well, he did get us into the city, right? What else can we do? We're losing ground, and I don't fancy waking up in the gallows. out of your pockets just by smiling at you. But you, you don't have the style to work high down, let alone the Merchant's Guild. You might want to find yourself a new line of work. <laughs> Off you go. <gasps> How do you do? Merrick Tethras, at your service. I apologize for Bartrand. He wouldn't know an opportunity if it hit him square in the jaw. But you would. I would. What my brother doesn't realize is that we need someone like you. He would never admit it either. He's too proud. I, however, am quite practical. You're part of Bartrand's venture. That's right. The deep roads wouldn't normally be my thing, but I can't allow the head of our family to go down there alone. So, as you might imagine, I have more than a passing interest in this expedition's success. What makes you so certain we can help? You know nothing about us. Oh, on the contrary. You've made quite the name for yourself over the last year. The Coterie has been squeezing smugglers out left and right, and the only group to survive owes it all to you two. The name Hawk is on many lips these days. Not bad for a Ferelden fresh off the boat. You must have heard of my brother as well, then. A little, yes. But it is you they speak most of, Nasser. That figures. Your brother is certainly welcome to join us by all means, but I'll leave that in your hands. Oh, I'm going. Without this expedition, we won't last out the year. You're going awfully far out of your way just to hire another guard. We don't need another hireling. We need a partner. The truth is, Bartrand's been tearing his beard out trying to fund this on his own, but he can't do it. Invest in the expedition. Fifty sovereigns and he can't refuse. Not with me there to vouch for you. Your brother doesn't seem like the sort who's willing to split profits. My brother is many things, but he is not stupid. Far better to share the profits than be trapped in a tie with a thousand darkspawn between you and the exit. Trust me. He'll come around. Why would you stick your neck out for a complete stranger? I'd rather take a chance on someone with your reputation than head into the deep roads unprepared. And besides, we'd be your partners. I'm willing to give a little trust if you are. I hope there's more to this. Like how I'm supposed to get that much coin together. You need to think big. There's only a brief window after a blight when the Deep Roads won't be crawling with Darkspawn. The treasure you find down there could set you and your family up for life. Come on. The Dwarf makes some sense. No offense. Look, you started this, and it's a good idea. Certainly better than ending up in the gallows. We work together, you and I, and before you know it, you'll have all the capital you need. What do you say? There might be nothing down there except Darkspawn and Rubble. How can you be sure we'll make a profit? Well, Bartrand isn't grasping its strings. He's operating on some good information. Some of the Deep Roads are so old, even the Dwarves have forgotten them. We just need to get down there, then Bartrand will lead the way. You and I will be there to handle problems. What makes you so certain you'll be useful to me? I know everyone in this city worth knowing. I can help you find the jobs you need, and if you don't need me for that, there's always Bianca. You named your crossbow. And why not? She's a beauty. Isn't that right, sweetheart? It's not like I had anything better planned. Perfect. Kirkwell's crawling with work. You set aside some coin from every job, and you'll have the money in no time. Sure. Easy. But... Maybe Aveline's got some bounties out. She joined the city guard, right? 
We should talk privately when you get the chance. In the Hanged Man, maybe. I'll be there when I'm not with you. Now, let's go see what trouble we can stir up. Ah, High Town. Where the rich go to piss their money away. <laughs> this really is the best place in Kirkwall. Sebastian, stop this madness. The Chantry cannot condone revenge, Sebastian. It is my right, my duty, to show these assassins there is nowhere in the free marches to hide. This is murder. No. What happened to my family was murder. You know, Junior, it's eerie how much resemblance there is between you two. She's my sister. Of course there's a resemblance. Oh, you thought I meant Hawk. I was talking about Gamlin. Maker, I hate you, dwarf. Hawk, long time no see, my friend. Well, if it isn't worthy, the dwarf with the incredibly ironic name. <laughs> I only advertise the truth. You aren't still working for Athenral, are you? Your year must be up by now. I'm looking to become an explorer of a sort. I heard. Bartrand's hard to take, but his information is usually good. Hard to take? <laughs> That's putting it mildly. I'll tell you what. I still have my old contacts. You need some runecrafting done, I can arrange it for you. Take care, Hawk. Don't get dead. Another Ferelden Street rat? Are you here to waste my time, or do you actually have coin to spend? Actually, my coin and I were just leaving. Hey, I'm having a bad week. There are few Ferelden's of means in Kirkwall. Forgive me. Are you an armorer? A weaponsmith? 
My stock is varied. What all my wares have in common, however, is quality. Only the best for my distinguished patrons. See for yourself. Messer, please stop kicking. Who are you to talk to me like that, you bloody peasant? The guard who'll throw you out if you kick that wall. Hope the day is treating you well, sir. How much longer do I have? Hello, Hawk. That's it? What? Oh, right. Sorry. It feels like we just talked. I've been keeping an eye on you. Information is one of the few perks of this job. Watch out for Bartrand. He's a son of a bitch. You know I don't like it when you have people watch me. Saved me camping on your doorstep. After what we went through to get here, I... Well... You're no child, but I take care of my friends. The places they have me patrolling, I've got time. A person in your position. Seems like they might learn some profitable things. You know better than to ask that. One day you'll be frustrated enough to go for it. It's like I'm sitting on my hands. There are dangerous people in this city. In fact, I might have a job for you. Let me know if you want to do a favor for Kirkwall. Otherwise, I'm here if you need me. Maker knows I could use more satisfying work. Seems like Kirkwall suits you. It has been a challenge. Lots of opportunity. If you're the type the locals want. Are you? If you argue enough, you kind of convince yourself. It's been a year settling in. Are you all right? You don't need to coddle me. I am where I am. How close I hold my memories. ...is my own business. This must be a very different pace from serving King Kaelin. I love that life. But there's a new king for a new Ferelden. Seems cocksure. But I guess he was there when the Archdemon fell. Can't fault an active hand. It's just one more change, though. The real end for me was Ostagar. What about you, Carver? You were there. Do you feel something similar? No. All right, then. Bit of a tit, your brother. The blight is over. You could go back to Lothering. That wasn't home for me. It was just where the Horde pressed us. It wasn't the first village I saw fall. But you don't get used to people losing everything. It's not how I wanted to say goodbye. I'll say that. You can't go home again. That's supposed to be about maturity. It's not the same if you don't have the option. All right, Aveline. You have something worth doing? My patrols may be empty walks in the dark, but there's something big coming up, and I could use you. An ambush. 
probably for a caravan, although I can't find any shipments that match up. Doesn't matter, though. I women waiting for someone to rob. I'm putting a stop to it, my district or not. Do you have a name or anything else to go on? Not important. If we show up and they attack, they're bad. Simple as that. I'll wager it's smugglers, though. Like I said, seems like an obvious trap for a caravan. You've been nosing around outside your commission. I have contacts. And they're complaining about a lack of meat. Thugs and such. Someone is hiring. And one or two were told to prepare for travelers. You want to be good at this job? You pay attention to what's missing and when people arrange escape routes. Seems like you'd want to share this with your fellow guards. I will, if you sit on your hands. I'll send my alerts and someone else will lead a patrol. But there's profit and influence to be had. You're my friend, so I'm offering. I'm no guard, Evelyn. There's only so many of us. Temporary recruits are expected time to time, as long as they're competent. You still claim to be competent, right? All right, Evelyn. I'll play guard for you. I knew I could count on you. They're hidden up Sundermount, remote and rough, 